Hey everybody, this is Eric Norton, that's Justin Gruner, and we got one of the last few products for Tops to be released for NFL, right? Yep. Alright, awesome. Tops Fire. Tops Fire. It's their third year in I brought a little knife. He brought a knife, he's... I brought a knife. That's not really a knife, though, is it's it? It's not really a knife, is it? Or you're not knife. There you go. My not knife. That, that little knife went with me to, uh, to Iraq twice, oh, yeah. so... Never had to use it. I don't know why I would use it. I'm glad it hasn't tasted human blood. <laughs> that would have been very awkward. Yeah, it's like a little poke or something. <laughs> That's what the boxes look like in the car. Two hits, 150 card base set, but they price the rookies. It's for the rookies are numbered 1 to 50. Then they have 1 to 50 veterans, so they have we have an A and B version in our database. Okay, I see. So And then the last uh, last 50 veterans are just 50 to 100, 51 to 100 without anything else. Uh, parallels, obviously. Yeah, they have the different color parallels. They have an Inferno parallel, numbered one. Uh, you get a bunch of the inserts, and then two hits per box. Um, I pretty much the standard fare as last as last year's. Got a hit in the first pack. Excellent. Uh, Melvin Gordon, rookie patch auto. There's a little bit of a seam there. Uh, Melvin Gordon, number four fifty. That's the All purple right. version, I would assume. Uh, yeah, number to fifty. Then they have a. Copper, I think it was, or an orange. They have just different colors. I right, got a Le'Veon Bell parallel. I forgot what the parallel was called. I believe it's the flame or something like that. It's here's a base card. You got AJ Green. Uh, looks a little different than last year. Uh, last year had, uh, I mean, they have similar backgrounds, but this is definitely uh, done by a different artist. I think they talked about who was doing it. And this is an insert card for Calvin Johnson, who may or may not retire. That's a nice little insert. Do you know what that insert's called? Oh, gosh. Pretty cool. Love it. I haven't actually seen pictures of the inserts yet, so... Oh, look. Okay, this was Transcendent Touchdowns. What's the, what's the number on the back of that one? This one is ITW. ITW, let's see, in the, Into the Wild. So into the Wild, the okay, I dig it. And then they have that's Forces of Nature, so there, that's what it was. And then they have a Fired Up uh, insert as well. Oh, yeah. So. Oh, fat fingers. It definitely has a, uh, it reminds me a lot of Tops Valor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Products, yeah. It's, it's very similar to that product as well. There's Barry. And here's the uh, forces of nature. Uh, you got lightning and stuff like that in the background. Peyton Manning, Super Bowl champion. And the Devin Smith parallel. Dan Marino insert. And Devontae Adams. And they do have some retired players, such as uh, Ronnie Lott. So you will get those cars in there as well. They look different, I guess, than the uh, the current players. And I have a Arian Foster number to 499 parallel. Uh, I believe this is the I believe this is the orange. And you can tell from this little sliver right here. I believe that's what it is. And then the numbering is get it on the back right there. Nova Gordon. Amir Abdullah. Big, I like it. It's, I, I like that it's not as busy as last season's. Yeah, it's it's and definitely simplified down. Um, it's but, it, but it still puts the point across. Yeah, it's got like the paint splatter designs sure. and stuff in the background. It looks pretty neat for a lot of these. Mr. Tom Brady. Mr. Cam Newton. You know, Those guys have something in common. They both lost to the Broncos. <laughs> they both did indeed lose to the Broncos. So we got a uh, Deion Sanders and Warren Moon. I have a uh, Demarius Thomas into the wild. Here's Amari Cooper. And a Tony Lippet. Lippet. One of those. So here's rookie. Here's the parallel of that rookie. Very nice. Into the wild. Richard Sherman's love the... Of the Seahawks in the background, which are not actually animals, so good job. I'm sure they just picked a random hawk then. Roger Stallback. Captain 
America, Captain Comeback, whatever you want to call him. Yeah. I just realized I handed that knife to you very awkwardly. I'm sorry about yes, that. Yes, you did. My bad. Okay. That is not professional. Here's a uh, fired up Le'Veon Bell. This is actually looks really cool, like all the different poses of him getting into the game. Hmm. I'll top your Le'Veon Bell with an Antonio Brown fire. Excellent. A couple of Steelers. Well, Antonio Brown finished second in the MVP voting this year. So what do you think about that Super Bowl? Eh, Enjoy it? I thought it was quite boring, actually. I, I kind of did, too. I, I like seeing the defensive stuff, but, you know, I wanted a little bit more. Yeah, give me something. Put a Terry Bradshaw parallel. I got a uh, Jameis Winston parallel, Tim Brown, and a Alvin Bud Dupree. Bud. Bud. It's a name you don't hear enough of. No. Bud. It's kind of a an older, like, from the 50s or something. Yes. I have an Uncle Bud. Yeah? Yeah. It's enough of my family history. Hey, here's Bill Jackson. <laughs> what, was, what was her name? <laughs> Your nana's name? Was it Nana? No, Nanny. Nanny. Oh. Nanny. One day we'll get him to tell a nanny story. It's the greatest person that ever was put on this planet. Nanny was the greatest person ever put on this Love planet. Love Nanny. Here is a... You got RG3. Deontay Greenberry, Dallas Cowboys. Now here's one of those... Uh, What's one of these? Transcendent touchdowns of Marshawn Lynch, who is going to be announcing his retirement. And uh, Earl Thomas. Beast mode, no more. Yeah, no more beast mode. Sent the picture on Twitter of actually hanging up the cleats. Saw that, liked it, retweeted it. There you go. Are you on Twitter? Uh, sort of, yes and no. I'm trying to start a, uh, a production company, so ah. I put that on there, but not me personally. Though. Broncos into the wild. Demarius Thomas. You can follow me on Twitter at Eric Norton 316 at Eric Norton 316 If you feel like it, if you don't want to, then you don't have to. Okay. Yeah. Lots of Becca stuff going on Twitter, too. I can see you doing a lot of wrestling stuff. Uh, I make fun of a lot of wrestling stuff. <laughs> gotcha. I got a Matt Ryan uh, into the wild, a Javorius Allen, and they call him Buck. Buck, Buck Allen. Allen. Yeah, I, I dig the, the inclusion of the, uh, the older guys. The older Eric Dickerson, Tim Brown for you. So Steve, of the of the newly yeah. reformed LA Rams. Yes, yeah, Steve Young there. Here's a Golden Tate. I do a good package all together. I'm going to show the whole thing. Golden Tate, Rob Gronkowski, and Devin Funches. Very nice. Yeah, uh, Lawrence well. Taylor and Terry Bradshaw in mine. Those are my two that I'm going to show. Honestly, I'm just trying to keep pace with you because I open cards slower than him and Brian. They like to zip through them. Here's uh, John Elway. Oh, I got my first hit. I'll hang on to it for a second. We got a uh, Aaron Rodgers, Clyde Walford, Walford, Walford. Yeah, and uh, my hit is a J a J a J a J a. Yeah, that guy. A J a. It's a sticker autograph numbered to seventy five. So I believe this is the orange or blue parallel. I can't remember off the top of my head. There you go. Tyler, lock it. Lock hey. it up. And Jameis, just crab legs himself. I guess they made fun of him because he went to a grocery store and he actually paid for them once. Oh, he paid yeah. for them. He paid for them and he made a joke about it on Twitter or something. That's funny. Gail Sears, Colin Johnson, Jordan Nelson. I like those in the wild. Here you got a Deion Sanders from the Falcons. Rob Gronkowski. They really can't do one for the Cowboys, I'm thinking. They could. Really, I mean, they could. I guess it'd be a horse, but do you, you want a guy with a six-shooter on a horse in the background? Jerry Especially Rice. since they already have the Broncos. Jerry Rice. Nice. There was a there was a joke that came to my mind there, but I'm gonna leave it alone until after the video is over. Okay. Apparently, this is it's not a PG thirteen joke or. It's not. You know, it is a PG thirteen joke, but just for the sake of the sponsors, okay. if we you have sponsors, Franco Harris. <laughs> and I got a Jalen Strong rookie card. So yeah, nothing fancy with the rookie cards in this set. No, no autos or uh, mem autos. They're all the inserts. So it, I mean, it'll make it easier for me to price this product when yeah, it comes time to price. And this is definitely one of the more affordable products. I think this is you know sixty or seventy hey, bucks a box. Here's a Gronk for you. 
doing that touchdown celebration. And I got a Philip Rivers, um, number to 199 parallel. Oh gosh, I think this is the blue parallel. It's kind of hard to tell with the, with the background because it's all paint stuff. So it's really the only way you know, really, for me, is looking on the back with the print runs. Oh, and here's a Marcus Mariota rookie card. I still got my. I still got one more hit left. You go. got one more hit. I got three more packs. Oh, and here's a hit of Duke Johnson, number to seventy-five. That's not a bad one at all. No. I'm gonna show him because he's one of my all-time favorites, Mr. Earl Campbell. And I actually got an Earl Campbell as well. Awesome. In that same pack. Forces of Nature, Jameis Winston. We could have a little bit more going on in the background there. A pirate or something. But then, those are Forces of Nature, the lightning. Yeah, I know. The tornado would have been really cool. Yeah, there you go. Alright, I got a uh, Richard Sherman Seahawks, the, the Into the Wild. So you get a bunch of these Into the Wilds. I think they're like one in three or four packs. So, you definitely get an insert or a parallel in every pack. Yes. At least you're not getting. Jeremy nothing. Hill into the wild. With those Bengal Tigers in the background. Very awesome. Here's a Brashad Perryman, number to 299. It's either a gold or a purple. I, I think it's a gold. My final pack. I got two left. So, this is all checklisted in. Oh yeah, this has been in the database for a while. I'll probably be pricing it next week. Okay, um, awesome. It will not be in this issue of the magazine. It'll be the, the following. following issue. So the May issue. We got a Marcus Mariota parallel. And a Steve Young. Very cool. So Devin Hester. Hey, and the Gail Sayers. Why not go out on top of the Gail Sayers? Well, I got a bonus hit. Oh, awesome. So thick that I only have two cards. That was the patch. So I got Eric Dickerson as my card and a Jerry Lankford patch autograph with a nice three color patch here. Number 14 out of 75. So nice. my box over delivered. You did over deliver there. Here are my three hits. I had two hits. So a stack of, stack yeah, of stack cards. Of cards. To go through. You said about 65, 70 bucks? About that, yeah. It's not bad for. Not at all. Yeah. Well done, I, Tops. I like the uh, price point. I like the. I like everything with it. The hardest thing for me, though, that I wish they would have done a little bit differently was the parallels, just so I could see them more clearly, I guess. Yeah. They're kind of hard to differentiate. Um, other than that, I mean, everything is pretty good to me. I, I enjoyed it, and getting that bonus hit is definitely a, uh, a plus. I think, yeah, for the price point, that's, so. that's, a, that's a nice uh, nice little plus for you there. Exactly. Cool. So that's what we think. Why don't you tell us what you think down below. And until next time, I'm Eric. I'm Justin. Just keep ripping.